Whether or not you play Ark or just watch it, everyone loves to see raids and obviously base defences and this video has it all. As always, I dominate in every PvP fight or so I think. Um, we also have to defend our insane Lunar Cave against the Alphas who have insane loot and tames. Yeah, we definitely didn't get wiped there, I'll just let you watch the video and see what happens. Let me not forget about trying to raid the admin's raid base for huge loot and many more enjoyable moments. Let's jump straight into the video. So last video we finished up on Gen 2 where I got slammed at a raid base as you can see from this clip. However, we weren't going to stop there, oh we wanted God. to try to raid this raid base and get some loot. However, there was a lot of competition over here. Over three tribes were here fighting for the loot and fighting to raid the raid base. So this should be very interesting. So oh, they get, they've got a fob down below already, by the way. What's the fob? And there's a fob the other side also. He in fact definitely didn't have the ESP, I don't know why I'm calling it out so soon, uh, he probably just had a K mode on the mesh. AC4, uh, just like blow him, like just fair beam all down. Fair beam off the back of the tribe. Yeah. Why? Why's my eye pitching? Does he see me? Fair beam off of the tribe. I can't, bro. I'm gonna get grappled into Tyrus. Oh my Just god, bro! Oh, he's in the car. Tech gen. I don't have a tech gen. You don't have a tech gen? I'll stop Fabi. Who's that? He's, he's running to the thing. He's coming, 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 he's coming. I've got no shadows, but no, I'm he's trying. Coming. Ellie is uh, about to be behind you, behind you. Oh my god. I can't. Nice. I can't hear anything when you're screaming in my mic. Killed, killed the guy about to blow the vault. Yep. Nice. I don't know if it's all. Is it all soaked? Is it all soaked? Uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, it I is. Think so. I think so. Yeah. This is the kid on the Terry. Yeah. He's blown the fall right now. He's blown the fall. I didn't pre that. This dead, I'm probably dead also. I'm dead. Oh. Yeah, I forgot fairies are absolutely ridiculous and they're like 3x buff and resistance, which is crazy because they're good how they are. Uh, anyways, I came back to the base uh, just to check up on it and I'll show you what happened. Before I get further into this one, let me tell you about Anbu4man that is wiping this Saturday. It's actually my co-owner's other cluster and it had 1,200 pop on wipe day and features loads of great stats and features you guys will love and enjoy. It. So what are you waiting for? Make sure you go join the Discord, top link in the description and I'll see you guys over there. And you never know, I might be playing also. What's happened here? Bitch just was watching Euros. Uh... Like nothing. Bro had C4 and there's a spinal literally out there. Uh, I might just have to quickly LB Jordy's kit just for a sec and then I'll just give it back if I don't get slammed. If I get slammed, then <laughs> his kit is gone. Why is. Oh, oh, my bind is messing me up. I actually. He blind. He might be blind.
No shadow stake is so rough on this terrain too. How have I bottled that then? Oh my god. I just bottled that proper. Dead. Yeah, thank you. Right, I thought I bought that whole fight, but I'm good. I then needed to farm some element and obviously I was going to do that in the massive Ellie cave on gen 1. This is literally like the lava golem of Genesis. There's always people inside here farming or PvPing. Uh, so yeah, we might get into some PvP here. Got it right there. I'm going to pretend that like I'm farming. So I saw a player trying to hide behind a rock over there and I think he was just going to try to kill me when I run out. So let's see what happens, I guess. He knows. He knows us here. Oh my god, Furry's one tap. What? Like, what? They literally one tap. So as you can clearly see, I'm not having too much fun with fairies in this video. I've been slammed by them twice already in this one. Uh, but yeah, they are pretty broken to say the least. Broke. And I kind of want to see. And this is probably going to get raided if I sleep though. I might just sleep. Be real. That's an L. But fairies up, bro. Right, I'm guessing we're raided. It's going to be a shame, but I should have probably stayed on. And uh, oh my god. We are actually not raided. Uh, are these soaked? Some of these are so. Wait, are they soaked? Or did I just not put bullets in that one? No, they're not sold. Oh my god. This is like day one and a half now. And somehow, no one tried to raid us. And we was offline for quite a bit of time. Um, I need to go edit a video, so I'm going to be off again. But today we actually need to make some decent progress, otherwise we're going to fall so far behind that it's not even going to be worth playing. Actually, I'm going to do Ellie Run and all of that now and then go edit. Or then go gym and then edit. Yeah, that's the plan. Uh, but yeah, I did actually build this whole doors and then Julie just like layered the entire area out behind, so that's nice. Uh, yeah. And even at non-peak times of the day, I went to go farm some more element and guess what? There were people in the Ellie cave once again. Hopefully this time I don't get slammed and we win this PvP fight. Bro, it's just cringe, blood. And he missed his shotgun shot to kill me. Crazy. It's just whip spam. Let's go. I love a bit of whip spam. Bro, I literally can't do nothing. Without a shadow stake, it's just impossible. Bro is naked. Oh my god. Without a shadow stake, it's just horrible. Oh my. Please take yeah, the Ellie run on you. A little bit, not too much, not too much.
We're getting fobbed. <laughs> I literally just see TV. Oh my god, I didn't mean to do that. And we probably don't even have any fire though. Bro, that's crazy. They That fob wasn't there a minute ago. It definitely wasn't. Um, and we haven't even built our wall. Our main crafting station is literally still in the tunnel, which is not good. Um, yeah, definitely not good. We have got turrets sort of outside. Um, the wall's sort of built. There's enough turrets there right now. Um, but yeah, we are actually getting fobbed, I'm pretty sure. I mean, there's a TV outside and they just TP'd in, so... Definitely getting fobbed. But I doubt. With a skiff, too. With a skiff is crazy. I don't know how tanky skiffs are. Oh, not tanky. Oh! Thing is a one tap. The skiff is actually a one tap. There's fobbing us with a skiff. I literally got it no joke, like one tap. What? They're fobbing us with a skiff. Like, I haven't seen a skiff on Ark for like, literally years. I mean, I don't know. They've got like a TP right now, just trying to clear spam, but I'm gonna go play some more spam. But we're literally still built in our tunnel, so that's not good. So as you just heard there, we haven't actually moved into the back of our cave yet, which was a problem because they literally had to soak or destroy like, what, 20, 30 turrets and they'd get into our main loot area. So we had to farm, build the back of our cave and defend at the same time. Uh, this should be quite fun, I guess. Uh, yeah, there's, yeah, that's all that Ellie that we've got. So we sort of need to keep our entrance, not far. Coming into turrets with me. One's dead. Oh, okay. Uh, uh don't know flak. Yeah, don't know flak. Uh, there's a there's a turret up on that um thing that I need you to blow. I don't have C4 on me right now. I don't have C4 either. And you get C4. Well, we we need this pillar, like. So I guess that was sort of a good thing they had Dono stuff and sort of a bad thing because we needed good flax so we could sort of farm kits off of them uh, but obviously they would have better stuff to try to push our cave so yeah it's a good and bad thing. Clip to there, there, there's one above you. Oh, okay. I don't even really have that good of a kit. I mean, I have a basic kit. They've got cat flak, so they clearly have kits. Yeah, just don't let them get foundation control outside. And we might need to move our base to actually the back in a bit. Because... Oh, and then we got a lot of Ellie, then we can move to the back. Fill our stacks up at the wall. No, it's dead. I think I got actual kit from this guy. Luna is so ridiculous. Like, you literally just have to get one, even if they're cutting. Yeah, I got kit. Well, yeah, better flat back. Not a full kit, but. Like five feet, I think. So, like, nice. we retire to get that. They're just chucking stegos in. Right, our, our turrets aren't going to be able to cope with that. There's nothing on that stego. Um Wait, we must get we've we probably got a wire in. There's lunar flyers in there. Yeah. Yeah, cool. You could just pick it and probably just fly it to like Big Luna. Big Luna. Yep. Yeah. That is the plan. 
uh, what's it called? Wyvern. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Poison Wyvern will do. And to be fair, it was such a boring defense. They really didn't want to do too much whilst we were online. They're literally just waiting for us to get offline, which was sort of smart from them because Judy actually had work like really early in the morning. And I wanted to watch some of the Euro games. And uh, yeah, we weren't being too active this wipe to say the least. But I went out and got some more element because we literally, once again, had no element in our base. Run a PT. A guy on a PT on Jen. Okay then. This is This is a uh, a new one. I guess. Never seen this one before. Okay, blood is a, okay, <laughs> it literally had nothing, but yeah, uh, running on a PT on Jen. Oh my god, actually he did have something, I would definitely take that, 100% we'll take that because hide and meat run, very, very worth it, um, that is huge. So I want to get some sleep now, um, I have actually built it inside, but uh, these were here like 6 minutes ago and it looks like they're just waiting for me to get off, um, and as soon as I get off they're just going to try to raid me, which outside won't take them too long to drop, they've got cap stego saddles and like stegos and that. Uh, they chucked a few in but I did actually build the wall um, the wall don't have too many bullets in I don't think it's got an okay amount but whether or not this will last a night I don't know um, it's hard to raid it is a 1x lunar cave so it, it's it's not an easy raid um, but hopefully when I wake up and not raid it um, that would be nice these aren't even filled up so long story short we did actually get raided overnight which is a bit of a shame but I'm not gonna quit my wipe there I'm actually gonna go solo from now on and see what we can get up to and trust me we get so so many raids in anyway I did actually get given some loot from the people who raided me he messaged me after he raided me and uh, just basically explained what happened which fair enough uh, but yeah, I was coming over to Lost Islands to check this insane underwater rat hole spot. Uh, but sadly, it was actually built in and there was quite a fat base inside. So I really couldn't do much to it. I think the spot that I wanted to claim is taken. Is it there? It probably is. Yeah, it's right there. He's online too. There's only one turret outside, that one C4. Oh, he did actually give me C4. Wait, let me make sure it is just one turret. Because I've literally got everything that guy just gave me on me. But if it is just one turret. I want to see how fat they are on the inside. Oh yeah, they're fat in the inside. We're not going to be able to do that. So I was actually going to build a different spot on centre. There was one spot where in the puzzle cave you can actually get like underneath the lava. And there's a little rat hole pocket that I've never shown in a video before. So I guess you'll see that. And then if that one don't work, there's also another spot that I wanted to claim. But they're both on centre. So let's get some Ellie here and get going. Yeah, that's why I can do it in the boss because no one knows where I started it. Oh, you can shoot on yeah, this no, I'm, oh, let me get that no, team I'll, I'll buy it off you. Oh, look. Yo, let me get that team Yeah, let me get I'll that, bro. Give it, I'll give it, that, oh. give it, I'll give it. Let me, I'll buy it off you, bro. I'll trade it, I'll trade it. Like... All right, I'm doing a trade, though, because I got so lucky. And this guy needs this saddle. And I said, uh, I trade for, like, every resource that I need for the uh, Tappy Saddle BP because I'm not going to use Tappies or wipes, so 
it's definitely worth it from my point of view. And I've literally got so much resources uh, from this, so that's literally all I need to be fair. Uh, boom. And then I pretty much started up a charity at this rate. Uh, I was just asking random people in the VC that I was chilling with if they want to donate to the charity. And funny enough, this guy came over and literally gave me a full set of insane blueprints. Uh, later on in the series, these definitely don't despawn in my upload accidentally. Uh, that definitely didn't happen. But yeah, this was going to be a massive help, especially for some of the raids that I was going to do. He's pretty shit. Oh, that's BPs, okay. Yeah, I dropped it. You need a shorty BP, it's only 172. Uh, I think someone gave me one thing. But Bruce gave me a full set of dono BPs. What? So I know you guys don't like me taking any sort of dono stuff or like just handouts off of people, but it was like five days into white and I really didn't want to start from like beginning, beginning again, but I still wanted to play. So yeah, I'm sorry if you didn't want to see this sort of stuff, but... Yeah, let me know in the comments because I'm always happy to hear opinions. So on that note, sadly, that is going to be the end of today's video. I really do hope you enjoyed the video. And if you have made this far into this one, make sure you put G91 in the comments and you have made this far, which honestly means more than anything. Anyway, guys, have a major rest of the day and night wherever you are in the world. And I'll see you guys in the next video.